Good morning and greetings from the University of Kentucky Transfer Office. So what I'm going to do uh, today is give you all a brief presentation on all things UK transfer related and talking about a lot of your opportunities as far as transferring to UK. So I'm going to go ahead and share my screen and do this via a PowerPoint presentation. So bear with me one second. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and begin by talking about the multitude of academic options at UK. So we have over 200 majors at UK. One thing I always love pointing out is that we do have a 16 to one student to faculty ratio. I think there's a misconception that if you come to UK, you're going to be lost in a sea of blue with 30,000 students. So it's important to note that the student to faculty ratio is really important in offsetting that uh, misconception. I also love pointing out that 85% of our classes have 50 or fewer students. Now, this is particularly true for transfer students because you have a lot of those gen eds or will have a lot of those general education courses already completed by the time you come to UK. So those classes are inherently going to be a little bit smaller. So let's talk a little bit about admissions to UK. Now, these are some important deadlines to keep in mind. So let's say, for example, you're looking at next fall. Your application deadline would be uh, next July 1st. So the application for fall 2024 will be opening in about two months. So what I always tell students to do is apply earlier rather than later. And so let's say, for example, you are considering three schools. Apply to all three um, as early as you can. And I would say apply this fall to all three of those for the next fall's admission cycle. And that way you can get admitted early to all three. And then that buys you several months to make your decision because you're already admitted to those schools. You've already met their admissions deadlines and you don't have to worry about missing any of those deadlines. You can also see the spring, summer uh, deadlines listed here as well. So there are two types of transfer students, those who will be transferring in with 24 or more credit hours and those who will be transferring in with 23 or less credit hours. The main difference between those two categories is if you fall in the, uh, the category of transferring in with 23 or fewer credits, we need your high school transcript in addition to your um, gateway community transcript. If you are transferring in 24 or more credit hours, we only need your college transcripts, so Gateway uh, in this example, and the $50 application fee. However, I'm going to speak shortly on a way to get that fee waived, so I definitely want you to take advantage of that. And as far as transfer admission into the university, as long as you have a 2.0 or above, when we combine all of your college coursework, you are admissible to UK as a transfer student if you have 24 or more hours. If you have 23 or less hours, we look at your college and your high school transcripts, and it's more of a holistic admissions decision. So I do want to talk about transfer scholarship opportunities at UK. So the three you see on your screen here are what we would call merit-based scholarships, meaning you do not have to apply for these. You do not have to compete for these. So let's say, for example, you're a gateway student who's going to be transferring to us for next fall. Let's say you're going to be coming in with 3.62 GPA, just for example. You could see there you would get that Distinguished Transfer Merit Scholarship Award of 3000 per year for up to two years. So in order to qualify for these, you have to be transferring in a fall semester um, with 24 or more credit hours. Now, we do have competitive transfer scholarships. So these are the two competitive transfer scholarships we have, a trustee scholarship and a Phi Theta Kappa scholarship, otherwise known as PTK. So you can see the GPA requirements for each of those two. So if you uh, meet the requirements for the trustee scholarship, for example, on the left-hand side of your screen, um, you get to apply to that. You qualify to apply for it. You're competing with other students for it. We give out about 10 of those per year of each of these two categories, so about 20 total. And if you get the trustees, that allows you to carry your gateway tuition over to the University of Kentucky. If you are, are awarded the PTK scholarship, that's full tuition. So you don't have to pay anything in tuition um, if you are a Kentucky resident and you earn that scholarship. And as you can see here, Theoretically, you could qualify for both. And if you do qualify for both, by all means, you want to apply for both. You sort of double your chances of, chances of getting one of the two. Now, you're only going to get one, but um, absolutely apply for both if you do qualify for both. 
I could give an entire presentation just on the multitude of student services we have here at UK. Um, it's something that really stood out to me the first day I worked here was the the vast array of services available to our students. So we have free counseling for any student taking six hours or more. We have math tutoring labs, biology tutoring labs, chemistry labs. We have a writing center. We have um, Presentation U, which will help you really tweak and hone that presentation. We have an amazing career services center. They'll do mock interviews with you. They'll help you polish your cover letter and resume and really set you up for success once you graduate here at UK. And in fact, a lot of our students will end up having a job lined up their last semester here because they've taken advantage of internships, the career center and things like that. So that's definitely something you wanna keep in mind. Um, one other thing I do wanna mention, definitely get involved if you're going to be um, coming to UK because we do have over 550 student organizations. So we have a Marvel movie club, poetry clubs, book clubs. Uh, faith-based organizations, um, et cetera, et cetera. So definitely get involved. It's a great way to network, make friends, meet people, and sort of shrink your campus and, and make your campus feel a lot smaller. So um, I mentioned earlier about the $50 application fee. We're going to be listing our fall um, Transfer Tuesday dates here soon. So that will be a series of dates starting usually in late August or early September. We have about two per month two different Tuesdays per month, where if you apply on that date, you don't have to pay the $50 application fee. So those are not posted yet, but they will be posted um, in about uh, a couple of months, more than likely. This is my information, if you want to take a picture of that. That's my uh, phone number and email. I'll be your main transfer contact here at UK. I do visit Gateway um, a couple of times per semester at least, so I hope to meet uh, many of you in person. And lastly, um, I definitely want you to take a picture of this email address. So this email address is shared by our three transfer advisors. So whereas I do the recruiting, they do the academic transfer advising. So they can look at your gateway transcripts, let you know how those classes are going to transfer into your chosen degree here at UK. And furthermore, if you're still attending there at Gateway for another semester or a year, they'll help you make sure you're taking the correct gateway courses to maximize your transferability of those courses into your degree here at UK. Definitely take advantage of this. Just send an email to that email address and say, I would like to set up a transfer advising appointment. It's as simple as that. And they'll set that up for you, either virtual or in person. So that is all for this presentation today. I hope to meet many of you in the coming months um, at Gateway Community, either this upcoming fall or next upcoming spring. Please feel free to reach out with any questions. Thank you so much.